welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be my sydney vlog i'm currently not in sydney but again i keep forgetting to intro my videos i just go straight in with vlogging because i'm so used to weekly vlogging that that is just how i start i'll just start with the vlog straight away but obviously i feel like these sort of videos need a little bit more introduction so we spent three days in sydney exploring and all that jazz we went to karen's diner we went to bondi beach and yeah you're gonna see it all coming up in this vlog so if you do enjoy this video as always remember to give it a huge thumbs up down below subscribe if you haven't already and without further ado let's just get on with the video good morning sydney it's day two guys and tell me why the streets of sydney are absolutely oh, even this morning but we could get food because it's absolutely roll. starving and we're gonna get something to drink as well oh, and then today we're gonna go about and explore sydney so just went to the shop got myself some breakfast they didn't really have breakfast things hence the chicken lettuce and avocado sandwich I would definitely not normally eat that at 8am in the morning but I guess it is 8pm at home so if I think of it like that then you know um, but then I did get some banana bread and I couldn't help myself from getting a Kit Kat Chunky this is a different one though but it kind of looks like the stuff that's in it is going to be like creamy chocolate okay. I need to know what your size has attracted by. Good morning, guys. Today, I guess you can say, is our first day in Australia. In the <laughs> um, we're exploring Sydney today because we're here for a few days. We've got sort of nothing to do as such because we haven't actually planned anything that like we haven't got anything on our itinerary but we obviously are going to plan stuff but today it's just going to be a whole lot of touristy things just seeing some of the attractions and all that jazz so we're currently heading to Westfield because me and Sophie need to get an Australian sim card because our phones don't work here which is obviously ideal um, so hopefully we'll get that sorted and then we're going to go to like, the Opera House, the Harbour Bridge and all that jazz so obviously bring you guys along with me but it's so weird like it just doesn't feel real like we're here yet guys we made it oh my god I actually cannot believe I'm seeing this in person right now this feels so surreal this honestly is amazing I'm like so in love with Sydney already and we've literally been here a couple of hours Oh, it's just so beautiful. I can't so believe it. Wow, you are wow. beautiful. I'm touching it. Um, oh, sort of. Yeah, smile. <laughs> so we've just got the food. I got this little noodle bowl. My mayo does not look very appealing anymore. It was in like a nice fancy pattern, but then I put the lid on. I don't know why they've just squashed it. But yeah, I got spicy chicken and I also got garlic chicken. And there's noodles obviously at the bottom. We don't know what it's going to be like. I think it's going to be like a cheese. I tried to make it look like. So we got these cheese ones as well. Give me that pull I'm asking for. Oh no! Oh, is it not a cheese ball? No. Oh, but it's just not melted. It's not hot enough. Okay guys, so I accidentally formatted my SD card earlier. So in case I can't get them clips back, here's a little rundown of what happened. Basically we, obviously quite a few hours later, we came back to the hostel, we all had a little bit of a nap, some more than others, and now we're heading out to a club called The oh, Ivy, or oh, it's just Ivy. Um, Seb from my adventure project who we've actually come to Australia with has sorted that out for us as he knows someone Seb, man. who obviously like, works here and then they've also sorted things the out for man. us so we're going there very excited me and Haz when we heard the ivy thought it was going to be food so then I'm just in the, literally the same makeup as earlier changed my outfits I've got this IMG top on my black cargoes and then my trainers and I'm really hoping that you can I can get this footage back because I did actually do a full uh, TD and I like, told you where everything was from but Ooh, we don't have a mirror in our bedroom so it's kind of hard so I had to go into the bathroom so I hope we can get that clip but yeah we're walking there now anyway I'm trying to think what else I updated you guys on in case I can't get that clip back but yeah I'm going to continue to vlog throughout the rest of the night Hopefully it's not going to be a really late one because I still need to sort out my SIM card tomorrow. Um, but then I think tomorrow we're going to do like a ferry. So we've stopped by McDonald's for a cheeky burger before the club. <laughs> Anna in a happy place. <laughs> so guys, we are walking 
to the club. I'm nervous, like I can't lie. I'm really nervous. I'm However, I am excited and we did just hear some of the music and I it's feel like, like Australia is a little bit behind, behind on the times. Yeah with the current pop charts because they were playing Timber. Yeah, you and, and, uh, music I don't want to be popping my pussy to Timber by Kesha. <laughs> back home from our gorgeous night out everyone is so rude in the clubs aren't rude they? so rude so beware it's not hard to say excuse me when you're walking past someone the amount of times that's say, all i'm gonna like, say they just shove past you just go you could just say excuse me no, they're like four, we're back now we're gonna get changed put our jimmy jams on and go to sleep it's good morning guys it's Sydney day morning. two, technically. Technically, it's day three as well, because obviously we're all travelling. Me and Sophie are currently walking into the centre to try and find a SIM card. Well, not try and find, because we have found one. But yesterday, we forgot our passports, and we need our passports yeah, to head, get one. Did you tell them so the heads up, card? if you are going to get a SIM card in Australia, take your passport, because you need it. You can't get one without. And it was really annoying, because we obviously came all the way into town, then realised, and then by the end of the day, we just couldn't be bothered to come back out so we've had to come out early this morning to get one but hopefully after we've sorted that but we should be good optus is the yeah. best one they so say not to go Australia. to vodafone so it's i don't know how because anna's using vodafone but she has vodafone at home so i don't know if that makes a difference yeah. but yeah we're gonna get our sim card sorted and then today we're going to manly beach which is a different part of the island and you get a ferry to it and the ferry's like a bit like the tube you just tap in tap out so guys it's been a little bit of time we filmed a video for anna's channel eating mcdonald's i feel very full now but now we're gonna go ahead to manly beach and we're gonna view that part of the island um i keep calling it an island it's not an island <laughs> it's the country it's still in australia it's not an island, ignore me whenever I say island because I don't mean it. What it's just that? well it's just another part of the country. But the easiest way to get to it is via ferry, because it's you're coming onto the beach. But yeah, I don't really know what's gonna be there. Apparently there's good shops, good food, although we have just eaten loads of food, so maybe that's counterproductive. But yeah, we'll see. Let's go. Everyone's really excited. Woo! I'm really scared that the wind is going to be blocking my microphone. I don't have one of them little fluffy things. Um, but we're going to go ahead and get on the ferry and head to Manly Island. Oh, fuck! I keep calling it an island. It's not an island. Manly Beach. I actually hate myself. I'm going to hate myself about the whole thing. Manly Beach, not Manly Island. See, did you see how annoyed I got with myself that I actually got really annoyed? But yeah, we're going to go there. Cruise around for the day, see what we have to do, and it's, I'll update you guys on the process. So we just tapped in, and I used my Monza, and it was I think it was ten fifty Australian dollars, which worked out at five seventy five British pounds. So super cheap for a twenty minute ferry across to Manly Beach. We are in. 
I can't remember what it was. I think it was the wharf too at the very end, and then we get it from side A. So this is what it looks like in case anyone is coming with side A, the fast ferry. There is literally signs like everywhere that sort of say, but we're at the very end one. I think it's wharf two. It's what was outside, but I can't remember. So if I remember on the way home, I will try and film it for you guys. But it's all pretty signed, and I'm sure you can ask someone if you are a little bit confused. But you literally just tap in and out, kind of like a tube. So yeah, and if you use a Monza, Monza has the best exchange rate. And not only that, but it does also tell you that like how much you spent during whilst you're spending it. Um, I do actually have a code you can use with Monza. It isn't sponsored, but I think we both get five pounds if you sign up with the link. So, I mean, if you want free money, go ahead and do it. I honestly don't know what to get. Guys, I got a cookie. This is salted caramel and macadamia nut. Oh, it looks so chewy. Mmm. Oh, so not bad. Yeah, is that all right? That is delicious. Oh my god. Oh wow. That is incredible. So guys, just did a little bit of touristy shopping. Me and Sophie have been wanting a hat to wear, obviously when we're on the beaches because of the sun and whatever. And we both really wanted one that said, I love Australia. And we found one. So we both got one. Um, I'll show you that when we get back because at the moment we're currently walking to Karen's Diner. Then I also got a little badge that me and Sophie said that before we were coming, we said we want to collect like little pins we want and badges bags. Um, to put on to like document all the places that we've been. So we just got our first one and it says Sydney, Sydney. on the I front. I feel like mine in improv is yours like that. Yeah, mine sticks out a little bit, I think. But yeah, this is what it looks like. Super cute. So we're going to collect them as we go, obviously, up the East Coast and get ones from each place. Like I said, we're walking to Karen's Diner now. I'm a little bit nervous. I've never been to a Karen's Diner. I actually have no idea what they're going to say about me. I have a few ideas, but I feel like the ideas that I have, they're probably not going to say. Uh, so yeah, I'm just intrigued to know what they're going to roast me on. So stay tuned and you guys will find out, I'm sure. We have arrived. So we finally made it inside. So he's already been violated for her unironed charges on the crotch. Come with fries? No. Yeah, I'll get the loaded cheese and fries. The beef ones or the chicken ones? The beef ones. Okay. They're beef ones. Who beef? What do you want? So if I'm on YouTube right now, there was no permission. So guys, it's the next day. We're actually leaving Sydney today, so we're gonna head to Bondi Beach. But before we set off, we've got a time to get some food. So I've just got a little pit or wrap, which I'm really excited to eat. Then I got a dairy-free smoothie, um, and then I got a water as well. So I'm gonna eat this, and then we're gonna get our asses to Bondi Beach. Hi guys. Hi, we're at 
Bondi fucking beach, man. Good eye, possums. <laughs> so bonza. Let's have a bonzo bonzi beach. <laughs> Includes my Sydney vlog and I really hope you guys did enjoy it. Coming soon will be my Byron Bay vlog so I'm really excited to show you guys that. There's a lot of exciting things happening in Byron Bay so stay tuned and yeah that is everything for now. Remember to subscribe down below and leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and I'll see you very very soon with the next Australia vlog. Bye!